Okay, I need to manage my stamina. Check my back also, that's good. Okay. Salut survivors, welcome back to Solo Podcast channel in 7 days to die, insane pendulum playthrough for the day 3. So after uh, yesterday, a uh, difficult day, um, with a death, uh, <laughs> same as the first day. Anyway, it's in insane, so uh, I'm a bit rusty also, so I need to, to catch up. Uh, so I have been able to get the forge running. Thanks to the forge, I now have uh, an iron sledgehammer, an iron pickaxe. So we are uh, we are moving, uh, that's good. Now I have also uh, worked a little bit during the night on our uh, outpost here. It starts to uh, look cool and uh, safe from uh, birds from the top. And I even have a little uh, access to go to the roof if need be here. I need to be careful not to jump and uh, break my uh, ankle there. But uh, that, that permits to get a, a pretty good view here to the trader. I have chopped the trees around uh, immediate near, uh, nearby so that I can uh, have a better view and I needed wood anyway. So uh, what are we going to do today? Uh, we know a little bit of course this area and I got a new quest uh, for new buried supplies uh, in the north. We don't necessarily need it right now because we have plenty of clay but uh, look that's uh, well located. At the same time we are going to scout around the city because we don't know well uh, everything. And uh, clear the streets while uh, scavenging uh, trashes and stuff uh, along the side of the roads. Oh, and just before, uh, while I was clearing the trees, I was about to attack this garage. And then I was thinking, oh no, that would be more cool to do it uh, on camera. <laughs> so here we are. I was almost in and then I say, okay, let's do it later. Here it is. Oh, first time I try my new uh, toy here. Nice. Yes. Wow, two shots. I love my new one. Let's be careful. Upstairs, there could be one on the roof jumping on me. I need to be a little bit more careful. Good, so let's gather all the stones, cobblestones I can get. Uh, then, uh, as part of our visit uh, and, and the mission, there is one key goal. I would like, by the end of today, to have an idea, is there a good place yet to get our uh, starter base? I would like to build a, a starter base, and uh, I have a, a general concept on how to do it. But I wonder, um, there are different ways to do it. And I could either uh, build it in an existing POI, or I could build it on top of an existing uh, wide uh, road, or I could build it uh, close uh, on top of an iron mine to combine the iron mine and this. Oh, got it already when doing some clearing around here. So I am not uh, entirely sure uh, yet about that. And to help in the decision, then uh, best is to uh, look at the place around here, right? Right, this I will need it. Tuk, 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 tuk. Okay. I'm hungry. Oh, I had brought uh, one can. Then we are going to dig when we are there. So we will bring one uh, stem region one efficient digestion. Look, we'll bring one red tea and some cans. I already purchased now one rockbusters because uh, I will build the uh, the mine. Uh, that's uh, one of the goals. So that uh, during the night I'll be able to mine. I could be mining there. Here. Where I am now, obviously here, 
that's one option. Uh, it's at uh, close to the outpost, close to the trader. There is a lot of space around here, so I could uh, I could convert this into a starter base. Of course, that big boulder here will have to go at some point in time, and I convert here into a mine with a starter base on top of it. That's one option. I am not uh, entirely convinced. Uh, if we find a good POI, that could be interesting. Although it might be close to the trader, uh, because to build the pendulum, we need something like uh, 18 by 18 block plus some space around it. Oh, this is where there is a uh, grace. Uh, this is a huge pig. Um, and the super corn. Now, in the past, the super corn was really great. Oh, another mushroom. I really have a lot of mushroom seeds. I, I need to get started with the farm uh, sooner. Um, so in the future, we'll, uh, we'll come take care of that. But we are not going to build the base in there, obviously. Let's try to get a bit of XP and clear the surrounding at the same time. And practice. I lack of practice, so I need, I need more practice. Exactly, his little acceleration, he tricked me there. <laughs> okay, good. I have uh, the stew on me. I need more stamina. Let's wait for the stamina. There, when I'm careful on the range and the stamina, it's going smooth. I haven't take, uh, I haven't yet taken the uh, cardio, uh, cardio uh, perk. So when I run, I'm using a lot of stam for now. But I'd like to unlock the bike. I really, really, really enjoy the bike. Okay, we have a church here. Some abandoned building. Oh, did I bring the knife? Yes, I did. Always have an iPhone, an iPhone you, particularly in some uh, exploring, scouting. You know what? We might as well in our two do some wrenching around because uh, I will need oil to uh, to make Molotov cocktails for the whole night, and then it's going to give at the same time uh, multiple crafting uh, ingredients. So. Uh, so why not? Now I did already uh, use one wrench. After this one, I still have one more. I used it for the. Uh, okay, let's let's mark here. When there is something special here, like lead, I might need it for the uh, the uh, blender basamo or other things in the future. So now it's marked next to the church. Okay. There is a land next to the church and next to the garage on the opposite side. There was coal. Okay, right in his butt. <laughs> a bit of meat. I mean, I'm, I'm not yet cooking the meat, but uh, it's a bone, it's a feather. Chicken is always cool to have, right? Wait, I hear some noise. Here he is. Ooh, one of these. Uh, I I had seen on Reddit some of these uh, gardens, but I never had the chance to see it by myself. Oh, it did hit me. There is another one. Good. No, it was just a sound effect. I know there is another one. I'm waiting to be hungry enough, then I will eat the uh, nice meat stew or hobo stew. I forgot which one it is that I have. Okay. There is a garage. Look, we are more in a scouting mission, but all these garages I, I typically like to uh, 
attack <laughs> these garages because they are often workbenches so easy to get uh, cement, cobblestones, often uh, some uh, working sieve tools, crates. So, I mean, uh, scavenging an entire house takes hours and uh, doing garages at the end pays off really well. I, I need to uh, look a bit at my inventory here. Okay. The hobo stew gives food 64. I'm not yet hungry. That's a waste. Okay, let's keep uh, scouting around here. There is a road connecting to another place in the north. Good. This can be good for the sand here. When I will need to do the first batches of concrete, this place can uh, be useful there. We aren't yet there, but that's uh, one of the purposes when we scout. Then there is a cemetery, water tank. Okay, we haven't yet seen a swimming pool or what, so this water tank might happen to be useful. Ah, at the stamina cost, I better not miss. Okay, now we are hungry. Anyway, we got to eat uh, with our uh, tea to give it a, a buff, of course. And uh, the tea will also give us a buff for digging purpose. Oh, <laughs> yeah, one honey. Okay, cool. Good job. I see some more uh, buildings up there. You know what? It's still uh, 12 in the afternoon. I mean, the, the, the digging quest is not extremely important. Better have a little uh, scouting first. I can come dig uh, later. Okay, there is a nice mansion here. Then like a, a tier 3 house. I'd like to see, is it still residential or what is it? Ooh, it's a construction site. Okay, we'll come back here later. I don't have any cobblestone on me, right? No, I don't. Let's leave it here for now. And then after, that's another uh, house. It's a, it's a residential area here. It's funny, this one is not connected to any road. Ah, there is a small road there. Okay, okay. Now it's making sense. And there is a swimming pool just here, if ever. Um, it's one in the afternoon. I think that's, that's still worth it to go to do the digging. I want more eggs. We should be getting the bacon and eggs, I suppose. Oh, nitrate here. I'm low stamina, low health, encumbered. Let's learn from our mistakes. <laughs> 
Um, here is a T. Here is a stew. Okay, and I have no more penalty to my max stam right now. Ah, oh, man, these guys. Yeah, he's down. Okay. So, last time I did a lot of digging. I don't want to do so much digging. I need to be much better at doing that. So we are going to mark the place. Okay, good. Now we can go in it. Oh, but I still have the the circle this time. Ah, oh, okay, fine. Okay, I got it. I'm checking the surroundings first. Let's get full stam. When I'm going to loot, I'll be extremely heavy though. You know what? We are going to make a chest here. Because there is going to be a big fight. And anyway, that's a major intersection here. And that would be so much easier to just have a chest here. Okay. Let's empty the stuff in there. I mean, for instance, the shovel, I don't need that. The bones I need. Anyway, I'll come back in the future, but for now, I think that's, that's, that's not bad. Good. Let's go. We're going to have some action now. Let's get it. Okay, I need to manage my stamina. Check my back also, that's good. Okay. Okay, one down. Two down. Okay, there is there is just three at this one. Okay, probably a crowder nearby. No, no crowder. We can get back uh, these frames. And seal the hole. I forgot to uh, seal the hole on the first one, so when I move around with a bike or uh, any other vehicle, I won't fall. That's a mistake not to have uh, filled the, the previous one. I will fill it in the future. Okay, let's mark this place. It's our first drop chest. Okay, then here we scouted a little bit, it's residential, so we are going to keep going all around. Uh, is there anything I can bring with me that really matters at the moment? The farm, we said the farm might be great. I hate us changes. This, let's learn. 
Oh, a chum shouter. Oh man, that's that's like a whole night of great stuff here. Nice. Um, let's keep going. That was a much faster digging compared to last time. That's good. I I don't know why last time the yellow circle disappeared, and this time I still had the yellow circle. So this was much much easier, like 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 in the past. I mean, like in the past, like two months ago. <laughs> okay. Let's continue. We have a cemetery. We have more and more residential. Oh, wait. Isn't it a shop, this one? Ooh, pass and gas. Butcher's Pete. I think this one has a lot of dogs, no? Not sure. Hey, bit. No, it's a residence. Okay. Oh. Flashlight schematic. Ah, but that's uh, that's uh, relatively fantastic. Oh, by the way, while I was uh, digging, I got enough uh, now to get the tech to learn to do the workbench. That's relatively super cool. I'd like to get some painkillers in some of this trash. No painkillers so far. I'm a bit heavy, but I'm full health. And now I have a proper iron hammer! Nice, nice. It's a complete game changer. I mean, of course, my stamina consumption is much higher, but... Ooh, waterworks. Okay, so this one we will need to keep... Keep it when we will be at a higher game stage, and for now that would be a waste. A bit. I thought there is no uh, gas. Okay. Is there a vending machine? Oh, it's a new passing gas. Three thirty in the afternoon, and we have not yet found. Uh, wait, there might be a workbench here. I'm kind of encumbered. I don't know the the, the word on this. Oh, it's not bad. We could refurbish the pass and gas. That could be one option. There is a lot of space all around to build a pendulum adjacent. Yeah, so for uh, for some of you, you might already know about the pendulum hold base. Some might not. But so if you don't know in a, in a short words, uh, the pendulum uh, hold base is a base uh, where the concept is to have a uh, automated uh, defense more or less in short and thanks to this automated defense you have a relatively uh, easy whole night it's a end game base and the challenge of this playthrough is to find a way to build it uh, per phase in a dynamic approach and for that i'd like to start with the starter base and that starter base that's why we are looking a little bit around there is there a good starter base around here? And maybe the passing gas could be. That could be. That's one option. But so far there is no big road. Ah, no, it's because I just looked around here. But there are some big roads here. Because there is a trader. Our outpost. It's nice if everything is like, compact, close to each other. You can just do a quick run from one to the next. Okay, let's continue our clearing. We will have safe streets around here. Oh, as safe as this can be. Okay, but I am I'm kind of like super encumbered. Oh, we have a beautiful car that got uh, <laughs> stuck in the concrete. 
Our drop chest is a little bit far. Wait, our range. Ah, I could scrap that one. We did the two already. Yes, that one second. I don't know, it's when I saw I saw the shotgun messiah from the opposite side. So we spawned on the opposite side there. Here is the industrial uh, zone. Ah no, that's not the shotgun messiah. That's the shamway food one. Okay, let's leave the cows here. In this uh, industrial area, we will uh, be able to do more cars in the future. Another chicken. There are a lot of chickens. There was not so many chickens before. I mean, that's a chicken fest here. Right. We have some visit first. Good. Four hits. But I have only one point in sexual Tyrannosaurus and one put one point in uh, it's not Pummel Pete. It's what head smasher or what is this? What's the point for that? Skull Crusher, not Head Smasher. <laughs> Skull Crusher. Well, that could be a uh, Head Smasher, right? And then, let's look at the map. We spot started here. This is, here is a Shotgun Messiah. Nice, we have a lot of uh, cool stuff in our industrial zone eh? here. Yes, we see it there, that the, that the place. Okay, okay. Look, I think probably in the current condition, I don't want to build at the opposite side of the bay. Uh, the pass and gas uh, building itself might be adequate, but uh, yeah, to build at the opposite side, it's 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 uh, it's not ideal. We are back close to our hotel. I might need more laser soon, but no need to do it now. Now. We start to be extremely encumbered, but we are close. I, I could put another drop chest around here. To be honest, this intersection. Let's just put another drop chest so we can continue before ending this episode. We'll scout a bit further. Now, uh, some subscribers uh, felt that I would need to go a bit uh, faster in the uh, releasing of the episodes. And uh, I will try, I will try, but it's not... Uh, uh, easy per se for me because I play multiple games so I try to uh, alternate and uh, I will soon finish my uh, playthrough in uh, Night of the Dead I'm, I'm, I'm almost at the end oh peace awesome so I will then be able to spend more time uh, and continue this uh, 7 DTD playthrough as well as uh, oh let's mark it as well as uh, Don't Starve, and there are some new games showing uh, being released in uh, in uh, Christmas period, so that will be uh, great. Um, so I will I will try to be a bit faster, and actually uh, to build the pendulum, we'll probably need to go to day 28 at least, if not 35. And with this uh, sequential uh, approach. Uh, might take even a bit longer. Uh, again, mushrooms. Oh my god, that's 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 crazy. There's so many mushrooms. Okay, here. That would be nice to kind of clear the ground floor. Here we'll see one. I suppose there are many more than just one. Oh, 
don't want to be goner, ne? Oh, got the instant witch. Oof, got scared for a second here. Check the corners. And we'll be able to do all these cars. More duct tape. Okay, I don't really have time to scavenge the whole thing now. I am uh, encumbered and I need to uh, kind of make a decision on this uh, starter base or iron mine. Look, probably at the moment, here they are potatoes. Eh? Yeah, yeah, so I'm not harvesting yet these potatoes. They look brilliant here, right? But I want to spend a point in uh, leaving off the land first before harvesting potatoes, blueberries, corn, etc, etc. So, um, look, please let me know in the comments uh, if this is a starter base, I should build it in a POI. I, I have not really seen a POI close to the trailer that is really worth it, that is sturdy. And if in the end you need to upgrade everything, well, you might as well just build a clean and neat uh, in the first place. So, how I see it here, unless uh, I missed a POI, and let me know in the comments, two options. Either I should build the starter base on the road here in the south, so that I have a proper foundation. Or I would build the starter base there. Here there is an iron mine. So I could combine the iron mine with the starter base. It's close to the outpost, which is convenient. Now, I need to think in the future that I need a lot of space to build uh, the pendulum. But I could easily uh, tear down uh, some of the buildings here. So I could build a pendulum like that. Advantage of being on the road is that I can then build a, a pendulum here. If I'm thinking uh, uh, to have the, uh, the starter base and the pendulum uh, adjacent, it's because uh, I would like to uh, make use of... Oh, nice, SMG turret. That's cool, that's cool, really good. We got some good stuff. Uh, let's go give back the quest. Um, so, yeah, uh, I'm, I'm kind of a little bit undecided there. So, basically, the starter base could be either located at the back of the pendulum because when testing the uh, pendulum on the day 7000 uh, whole night in an insane a nightmare, I mean a super high uh, game stage um, I survived, I made it, but there was a little difficulty of some zombies trying to attack by the back so to make it perfect as uh, a pipe bomb uh, is not fantastic huh? Hmm. No, no. Let's get meds. For now. A new user dig? No. Painkillers. No, it's a bit. Uh... You know what? I have zero painkillers. Let's let's just buy one. It's okay. We have money. Okay. Yeah. Any cans? No. Did it already? Okay, so yeah, the, the, the starter base, as I was explaining, could be either designed to be at the back of the pendulum or could be in the inner core, because the core in the middle, that's from uh, where you, uh, you organize all the electrical network of traps. So here, my idea would be to uh, build a small mine, and this could be converted into a small base. We can make use of this uh, boulder here, of course. And we can uh, relatively have a good uh, flat uh, land all around. 
so there is no uh, risk of having a uh, oh, we don't get wood from that oh I thought I would get some uh, metals okay we don't <laughs> so this uh, starter base could be here or on the road or on a nearby place look I am not yet decided please let me know what you know uh, what you think in the comments and uh, in the meantime I will I think prepare here to have a little uh, mine very uh, simple just dig down for now that will be the, the simpler way at the moment and uh, we will see uh, later uh, we see are still day three to actually get the mine going I will get uh, stones and with all the clay we have all this clay and stones will permit us to um, to be extremely efficient for our uh, production of the cobblestones so I hope you have enjoyed this video uh, please uh, leave a like and subscribe and see you soon for more adventures cheers